Om Shanti. This is the Avyakt Murli of 21st of April, 1973. Title is Personal Meeting with Madhuban Residents. What would this group be called? What are the Madhuban Residents called? Do all those who are sitting here move along while considering themselves to be multi-million times fortunate? Madhuban is praised because of the Madhuban residence. Who creates the atmosphere of Madhuban? Do all of you experience in your lives the praise of the Madhuban that has been remembered? Madhuban is known as the great land. Therefore, the souls who reside in the great land must definitely also be that great. Are you so great that not even one thought is ever ordinary or wasteful, and that not a single deed is ordinary or meaningless. Every deed of a great soul is meaningful. Are you such great souls who are embodiments of that meaning? Such souls, that is, great souls, are Madhuban residents. Your name is Madhuban residents. And so your name would also definitely be filled with the significance of the meaning, would it not? So every day, do you check your chart as to whether the deed you performed through your physical organs were meaningful? Was the time you spent spent in a worthwhile way? That is, was it used for an elevated task? Do you check your chart in this way, or do you just check the gross things? Those who think that they check themselves in this way, raise your hands. Every deed of great soul is praised as divine activity. The image of being happy, the image that attracts, and the avyak image of great souls are remembered in the form of idols. In the same way, check yourself throughout the day as to whether your face is such that it can be used as an idol for worshipping and whether your deeds are such that they can be praised as the form of some divine activity. This is your aim, is it not? When you come here to learn and study, what is your final aim? What is the aim of the Confluence Age? It is this, is it not? The action of confluence age are praised as divine activity. The form of a deity is worshipped from the practical life of the confluence age. So when will that happen? It is the praise of this time, and so it should exist at this time, should it not? Will you become like this in the golden age? There, everyone will be happy. And so, who would say that a particular one is always happy? It would only be said at this time, would it not? Those who are not always happy would say that a certain one is always happy. Are you such image who are performing such actions in a practical way? You are smiling now as you listen to this. That is, you realize this. However, to what extent are you smiling? It is because you realize this is that you are smiling. So in the same way, you can instantly give a reply when you are asked anything because of your realization and the checking of your actions every day. At present, you still have to think whether to raise your hand or not. Why do you not raise your hand with intoxication? Why do you have to hesitate? What is the reason for this? So in the same way, when someone comes in front of you, put your perfect form into practice, not just into words, but into practice. When they go in front of your non-living image, they consider those to be elevated and very easily consider themselves to be degraded sinners. In one second, they are able to have a vision of themselves.
The image doesn't tell them that they are degraded, but they themselves have a vision. In the same way, those who come in front of you should experience for themselves the difference between what you are and who they are. You have to create this stage, do you not? When will you have this stage? Will it be when the course of knowledge finishes? It is now the realized course. It is being revised in theory or in practice. The course should also be completed in the practical form. Should it not? Or will the practical form be visible when the revised course finishes? What do you think? Are you waiting for this? Do you think that when the time comes, everything will be all right? When did you have this class? In order to intensify your efforts, do you make plans according to your capacity? Or will you continue to move along only when you receive ready-made plans? Bob Dada always sees that Madhuban residents are samples in front of everyone. Sample is prepared first. Are Madhuban residents samples? Or are the samples still to be prepared? When a sample has been prepared, it is shown as an example of the goods that are being manufactured. Only when others see the samples do they make a deal. When the sample is ready, Bob Dada should be able to give a signal and say that this is what they have to become. The effort to become a sample is not difficult. The effort is very simple. The simple effort in one word is that you must always keep the symbol of the Father in front of you. An effort of one word is very easy, is it not? If the symbol is constantly in front of you, the effort becomes simple. When the effort is simple, you will become a sample. How many engines do the Madhuban residents have? Someone replied, four. Then you should reach your destination in a second. You accept that the Madhuban residents have received the benefit of easiest effort and a golden chance. Do you not? You are clever in knowing and accepting this. You are clever in speaking anyway. But why is it taking time to be accepted by everyone? The more you are accepted and respected here, the more worthy of worship you will be there. If those who see your actions do not consider you to be elevated, how could be worshippers accept you as being elevated and become your worshippers? The more worthy you are of respect, the more worthy you will be of worship. Those who see the worthy of worship once become happy on seeing them. Now, is it you who have to become this? Or do you simply have to become happy and sing them? To the extent that you play music, to that extent, you have to be those who understand the full significance of it. You are clever in playing music, are you not? There are so many who desire to hear music. You have passed in that, have you not? To the extent that you are Sahes Yukt, musical, to that extent, become Razyukt, one who understand the significance of everything. Those who are Razyukt have every action filled with significance. You have to remain well balanced in being Razyukt and Sazyukt. Madhuban residents are the most lucky stars. To the extent that you are lucky, to the same extent, you have to be loved by everyone. Don't just be content with your luck. Luck is recognized by how much someone is loved. Those who are lucky will definitely be loved by everyone. Now, while seeing everything and doing everything, you have to perform the task of giving love to everyone. You have passed the stage of giving and receiving knowledge. Now exchange love. Just give and receive love to whoever comes in front of you or in connection with you. This is known as being loved by all. Lovely.
which does not have to be donated to Brahmins, that will be donated to those who do not have knowledge. So in the Brahmin family, be great donor of this donation. It is remembered that when you give a donation, the omens are removed. When you give this great donation, all the weaknesses that remain, all those bad omens will be removed. Do you understand? Now we shall see who becomes great donors in giving this donation. Love is not just in words, but it is also in thoughts. You should not have anything except love for anyone. When you have love for everyone, then the response of love is cooperation and the result of cooperation is success. If everyone's cooperation, there will easily be success and so all of you will become embodiments of success. Now we shall see this result. Om Shanti.